hands We should forget about this place But I don't wanna leave here If you're just gonna stay Changing like the seasons Been wasting all this time Should be like satellite Cast me on the sky Believe our fate For another day Right in these horizons We'll find our way We'll leave our fate And fade into the night Just follow me to paradise Just say we try Say the word and we can run Around the earth and around the sun Say the word and we can say Forget about that Guys, this is Kubuek here, and welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke. Last time, we battled Maxi with his insane, insane team of high levels trying to knock us down with an Entei, but we pulled through, and today we have to go to the Team Aqua base, but I don't believe we battle Archie quite yet. I think we have to wait, because I think you battled him at Seafloor Cavern, which is way down the line. But today we have to go through the Aqua Base and do all of that. We get some items, get some stuff. We get one encounter in there I know of, for sure. So, we're going to check that out. But, let's take a quick team recap, because we did a very a small amount of grinding. But I got literally, the whole team is 43 across the board. Nobody got any new moves, none of that. Everybody is just level 43 now. And, uh, we'll go over the, the, no, no, we don't need to do a full recap of moves and whatnot, because that's just wasting time, my dude. We got Aqua Grunts to, to smack and Pokemon to catch, and yeah. And, yeah, but hold up, let's check out our item situation, because I don't believe I ever bought items like I said I was going to, but I did, because I definitely got items. Definitely bought some items. Okay, okay, we're good. We are good, but I got everybody to 43 because I wasn't sure if we have to battle Archie in this upcoming uh, base. And beyond that, I don't even know what Archie's levels are, if they're going to be the same or worse than Maxi's or what. Because we do have the modifier, it's a whole bunch of jumbo mumbo, I don't know. I grinded to 43 because we handled a level 47. What? Mm, what, what? What do you want with Team Aqua? Our boss isn't here. Oh. He's gone to jack the submarine. Okay, so we have to go to the submarine then. Got it. Got it. I believe that means we have to go back to Slateport. Believe that we have to go back here. I'm not positive. Yes. Yes. <clears throat> Ugh, wait, this was the captain. Was he the nerd? Or I think he had a nerd voice. Oh, well, we're doing the nerd voice. Uh, yes, indeed. We intend to move ahead with our exploration. That's wonderful, Captain Stern. Thank you for taking the time from your busy schedule to talk to us. We hope we can interview you again with news of more discoveries. And they're gone. And they're gone. I actually like those sprites a lot, the cameraman and the reporter. But okay, Wew, that was my first time being filmed for TV. That was nerve-wracking. Oh, Kubowak, you're looking great. We made a huge discovery on our seafloor exploration. We found an ca underwater cavern on Route 128. We think it's the habitat of a Pokemon that's said to have long extinct. Why is my phone... Who? Who? Why is it right when I start recording? <laughs> Wait, this is... 
Captain Stern, I presume? We of the Flying Dutchman will assume control of your submarine. Your objections are meaningless. We expect your total cooperation. Just watch and learn what Team Aqua has planned. What, what was that, that all about? It sounded like someone using a megaphone. Where did it come from? It's from the harbor, the submarine. They're trying to take it. Kibwak, please come with me. We're too late, my dude. We're too late. Oh, not you again. You are tena- er, yeah, tenacious. That's a cool word. You are tenacious to track us here. That much I will give you. But now, no one can stop us. Uh, or will you follow us back to our hideout in Lilligo City? Fwahahaha. I don't know why they would say that. Like, why would they tell us where it is? What if we didn't know? Why? Why would Team Aqua steal my submarine Explorer 1? They can't be after the slumbering Pokemon at the bottom of the sea. But even if I were to chase them, I don't stand a chance against them. I'm going. I'm going. We're going right now. Not Swan. Fly, my friend. Fly, my friend. But okay. We didn't battle anybody, but I heal a lot. You know. You know, I really do heal when I don't need to, like, 75% of the time, but yeah. Alright, we have some Team Aqua to battle. We got some Aqua to handle over in this base. Paris, get out of my face. Yo, I gotta let you guys know that Cheese is a monster with Surf. It is insane how good of a monster and destroyer of worlds Cheese is because of Surf. Okay. Okay, we have so many items. We have a lot in here that we want to handle. So, okay. Okay, we have this item finder. We are not missing anything. We are not missing anything. We'll battle everybody too. That's another reason I didn't really um, grind too much. Is because I knew we were going to have other trainers in here to battle. So I was like, why am I going to do all this time grinding when there's other people in here that we're going to have the opportunity to just slap and take their experience you know we have a lot in front of us but we'll see i always say that and get less experience than expected we got a fluffy tail how pointless how absolutely pointless we do not need a fluffy tail but it's okay it is okay Ooh, this is this is if i remember correctly this is usually where we get the master ball going this way so, um, by us going this way, we are, in fact, enabling, um, ourselves to get an encounter, because this is where the electrodes usually are. So, our, what was that? It's not good. That's like a skitty. It's a Roselia. It's a Roselia. Oh, man. I mean, I'll catch it, but we're not gonna use it. It doesn't even evolve. It's, it's not what we needed. It's not what we needed at all. We don't need anything. Our team is good, but it's not exciting. It really isn't. It's a Roselia. <laughs> I'm over here talking about how it's a Roselia. We're fine. We're gonna get- we're, we're fine. We don't need this. It's not that exciting. It almost bodies cheese. That was a crit. We're lucky that did not body cheese. I am lucky that did not destroy, completely and utterly destroy cheese. Oh man, I don't even think I could touch you. I don't even think I could touch you, so I'm just gonna waste a bunch of balls. And if we don't catch you in three Ultra Balls, I don't care. If we do not catch you, it only took two, because it knew. It knew. Okay, Roselia. Um, you're a dude, and you're the Thorn Pokemon. That is a cool name. We're naming you Thorn. I'm not gonna use you unless... I don't know. I really don't see a situation where we'd want to use Roselia. But we do have, um, an Ice Heal. <laughs> we do have Venusaur, Deku. This is a different static encounter? It's a Skip Loom. I'm not gonna count them both. I'm not gonna count them both. We're gonna run. And a Dragon Scale. All right. Yeah, we weren't going to count both of them. I was, but I thought they were going to randomize into the same thing. But then they didn't, and I was kind of like, what? But the other one only randomized into a skip loom, so I'm not worried. It's We're not going to count both of them because of that. If it would have been something else, best believe, I would have been like, oh, we're definitely counting both. But it was just a skip loom. I won't count it. <laughs> I won't count it because it wasn't as beneficial as we had hoped. 
let's use all of our old uh, healing items that we do not need. That we do not need. We could use this lava cookie for the sleep. Uh, just get some bag space freed up. But okay, instead of getting a Master Ball and an Electrode, we got a Roselia and... I don't even know what kind of item, to be honest. What item did we get? Ice Heal and a... Uh, I don't even know the other item. A uh, Dragon Scale. So nothing crazy. But alright, let's just keep moving and bodying literally everything. <laughs> keep in mind, we are getting close to that... <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. We are getting close to level 45 in other preschooler Alex and preschooler Alex. We are getting close to other to level 45 trainers. And once trainers have level 45, they will be max evolved every single Pokemon. And we saw what that does. That gives us Hitmonchan and Entei with Maxi. So we'll see. We'll see what goes down. I don't think that's gonna hit. Surf only hits the other side. I know I always say this, but I think we've established that Surf only hits the other side. But let's see. Let's see. Because if this Surf hits Groudon, it's very possible Groudon's going down. But I'm almost positive in third gen. I think in current gen, in like seventh gen, Surf hits everybody. But I think in this game, it only hits the other side. Don't hit Groudon. Okay. It didn't hit Groudon. He has Drill Peck? Okay, it's okay. We're level 43 Groudon. We're not we're not going down to that. Why do you have two Makuhitas? I'm I might add. I might ask why you got two Makuhitas, because I don't get it. Cause I don't get it. Okay, now you have a shoulder. Nice and Sheldon. We're just gonna body shoulder. Or he's gonna protect and not get hit at all. But he's getting bodied. He is getting bodied. Okay. Okay, get out of my way. Get out of my way. We have stuff to do. Items to grab. I really do have items to grab, though. We are grabbing all of the items. I feel like this was the correct way to go. I don't know. I don't know. I just want to get through this base, okay, man? I just want to get through this base. This is the correct way. So that is the way we do not want to go quite yet. We want to get items. I want to get every item in here because we have not found a single Master Ball and I want a Master Ball. Is this a Master Ball? No, it's a Soothe Bell though. And if we get a, a Gold Bat or anything else that evolves by happiness, that might help us. But honestly, the team we have now, let's, let's just look at them. I could see us taking this to the end. I could definitely see us taking this to the end. But if we were to get rid of something, I want to say it would be Jet. Because the only good thing about Jet at this moment is his typing. Other than that, it doesn't- we already have a flying type. We don't need the steel type. I don't know. If we found something completely and utterly, like, destruction worthy, he's going to wipe everybody's entire team. Yeah, we'd probably get rid of Jet for it, but... I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Our team is pretty solid, if I do say so myself. I'm just ready for the trainers we're battling to start having high levels. I love that. I absolutely love that in third gen. How oh, he becomes aware you're there, but he doesn't do anything. I don't know why. It was just different. Hehehe. <laughs> hey. Got here already, did you? We underestimated you, but this is it. I'm a cut above the grunts you've seen so far. I'm not stalling for time. I'm gonna pulverize you. Alright, so here is the admin with a level 41 gloom. Okay, we're fine. We are fine, my dudes. All right, not Swan. I'm gonna send you in to just arrow blast and show this thing what's up. Just show him what's up. Boom. Done. We don't need no glooms on our screen. No, not Swan is a beast. I gotta tell you guys, I was grinding, and that is where I realized not Swan is truly a beast. I don't know, I mean, I know it has Aero Blast, and Aero Blast is insane, but it just destroys everything. <laughs> Not Swan isn't the normal Pidgeot where you'd expect, like, oh, an average Mon deals average damage, might take a little bit to take something out. No, for whatever reason, our Pidgeot is just, it tears through anything. I, I don't know why I built it like that, but I did and I love it. Hehehe, <laughs> while I was toying with you, our boss got through his preparations. Now he is going to Kyogre. Hey, hey, our boss has already gone in his way to some cave under the sea. If you're going to give chase, you'd better search the big wide sea beyond Lily Cove. But will you find it then? Hey, hey, all right. All righty, we're done here. 
We're done here. That was literally fast. I feel like we might have missed out on items. I don't know. But you see how fast that was? We still got time in this episode. You know what that means? We got dumb encounters to get. We got dumb encounters to get. You know what? I don't even know, man. I don't even know, man. We're just mobbing. We're mobbing through this game. And that is okay. We're kind of getting close to the end. We got two more badges. We got a whole bunch of story. But besides that, we're getting pretty close. I don't want to battle you guys, but this is Route 124. Let me check our map. We have a, an encounter here. We have to look out for 125. There's an encounter there. If we go to Shoal Cave, we have an encounter there. Um, where is Shoal Cave, though? It's right there. We got Shoal Cave. We got 124. We got 126, 127. Where's 128? I think that is just over here. Yup. 128, 129, 130, 131, 132, and 133. Already got 134. We got Pacific Log Town. We have so many encounters we have now been opened up to. We might have a few episodes of just pure encounters. We got Moss Deep City as an encounter. We got underwater. I count underwater as one encounter, not in every area underwater. I literally count the underwater as one encounter overall. We're gonna have um, Seafloor Cavern as an encounter. We're gonna have Sky Pillar as an encounter. We got so much. We got so many encounters. We're gonna have Evergrand City as an encounter. So these are pretty much the rest of our encounters in the entire game is all of the water section of Pokemon Emerald of Hoenn, but we're going to go ahead and get our 124 encounter first, and it is going to be a Ninjask. You know what? The only bad thing about this Ninjask that I am not hyped about at all is its level, because I like Ninjask a lot. I'm actually a pretty big fan of the Pokemon Ninjask, um, but a level 5, obviously, it's hard to get a level 5 on the team, but Ninjask is fast. We got Ninjask. The ninja Pokemon, because it darts about vigorously at high speeds. No, Ninjask is cool. I like how it's speedy. I like fast mons. You are a girl ninja. We're gonna name you Hinata. We are going to name you Hinata. After the ninja from Naruto, as I'm sure many of you know. Okay, let's do this double battle. Why not? We have so many encounters I want to try to get to. That is a slow king. That is actually kind of surprising to see. That is actually kind of surprising to see because it is a water type or a fully evolved Mon, which we don't see much of. We really don't see much of that. I hope it doesn't use a psychic type attack because I just thought about it. Okay, I used a psychic type attack, but not on me. We're just going to surf again. And I am going to Razor Leaf because that also hits both. I wish it did more to the Slow King. I wish it did more to the Slow King, but hey. We kind of got the setup here for destruction. Okay, come on now. Come on now. There is no need for this. There is no need for this. I am just trying to get some encounters, gosh darn it. I am just trying to get some encounters, gosh darn it. We're going to keep moving. Because there are encounters to be had. But not here. This is still 143. Right? I believe so. Or 124, my bad. I said 143. So 125, um... Where else? 127, Moss Deep. I think we're gonna go to 125 next. Just, uh, for the sake of simplicity. And then we're gonna get Dive after this gym coming up. We got a whole lot. We got a whole lot. You know what? I have shards. I have shards. You might have something for me. Alright. What do you want? What? Here, we gotta go get our shards. I think they're in the PC, but we definitely got shards. We're in Moss Deep. We're in Moss Deep. Before we do anything in Moss Deep, I'm gonna get my shards. And then we're gonna get some encounters. And then, you know what? We're just gonna get the encounters first. We could do the shards anytime. Encounters are the fun part. Encounters are honestly the fun part. I'm not mad at all. I am not mad at all. I will take a Dusclops. Once again, I don't know if we're going to put it on the team. I mean, I, I would be lying if I said I wasn't tempted. Because I am tempted. I don't really know how to hurt you, though. You're level 15. You're a level 15. There it is. There it is. The Beckon Pokemon. It is thought that its body is hollow with only a spectral ball of fire burning inside. However, no one has been able to confirm the theory. You know what? It said spectral ball of fire. For some reason, that made me think of Chakra. We're going to name you Chakra. We're having all of the Naruto references. I feel like I spelt that wrong. 
I don't think there's a C. I don't think there's a C. We're gonna name it Chakra, though. So there we go, Chakra the Dusclops. I would be, I like, honestly, I'm considering taking uh, Jet off the team for that because it's just as bulky, I believe. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. I don't know, though, because that's a lot of grinding I don't want to do. It's a level 15. It is a level 15. But you do have pressure. You're holding a TM. You were holding a TM. You're special. Oh, no. You were just defensive all around. You were just defensive all around. Why is this happening? Um, let's check it out. Let's check it out. I know we're defensive, too. But, oh, man. I think we're going to stick with Jet. But we are going to take that item. We are going to take that item. Have no fear. I got to go and move items. Bum, 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 bum. Bam. Bag. And let's check it out. Let's check it out. I feel like we've already had TM37, though. Yes, it was just Dynamic Punch. Now we have two. Now we have two. I'm not teaching it. Wait a minute. No, we're not going to. I was going to teach it to Jet, but Jet's accuracy is already bad enough. We don't need any more bad accuracy attacks. Oh, man. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We're chilling. Did I heal? I did. We're getting more encounters. I don't care. I am an encounter fiend. We know this. We know that I am a fiend for encounters. We are gonna go up. Wait a minute. I'm gonna get. I'm. I'm gonna get a little bit, a little bit crafty with our Route 25 and Shoal Cave encounters, if I can. Hey, it's Steve or Scott. <coughs> what was him? Sonic. Sonic. It's big. I said Sonic. It's big. Sonic, feeling good? I'm doing great. I heard Monster Team's gym leader is pretty strong, so I decided to come take a look-see for myself. But there's something wrong about this town. People are going about a warning letter in the Space Center. Alright, later, Scott. He's talking about the Space Center. We have an item down here, too. There is so much in Monster Deep City. Max Elixir. I am going to be thankful for that once we get to, um... Once we get to the Elite Four. But yeah, uh, there's also, up here, in this building, we get a super rod. Boom, super rod. We're gonna use that, because it almost guarantees better encounters. I'm trying to get all the items, man. I am a item fiend. Oh man, who is Liliana? Who knows? I don't know what's up with this episode. I just know we got a lot of encounters available to us, and I'm speeding up a lot, but it's okay, because we got a lot of encounters available to us. And I'm excited for all of them. What are you? I don't even know why I'm talking to people. We're supposed to be doing encounters. But you know. You know, Steven's not even in here at the time. Nope. Nope. And we don't get his Metang or his Beldum until post-game. So that's pointless. That doesn't help. Alright. Yeah, Route 25, we're coming for you. I might save Shoal Cave for the next episode. I don't know. Probably not. Probably not. Who knows? But Route 125, wow, we got in a battle. With a dra Dragonair. Okay. Okay, but we can handle this. Okay. 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 Route 125. Our encounter is going to be... You know, we're getting some pretty decent encounters. I cannot hate on a Curlia at all. Because Gardevoir is a great, great mon. But we're... Uh, once again, we already have a Hypno. So it's not going to get used. But Gardevoir is a great, great mon. And Curlia is going to get caught the very first ball. Female Curlia, given nickname, yes. Um, I don't know any other... Actually, I do. Actually, I do know another Naruto reference we could use for this thing. Eno. Eno. I think I spelled it wrong. I think it's usually an I, but we're spelling it with an E. But Eno. And then Shoal Cave. I was supposed to fish. I was definitely supposed to fish, and I already forgot I was supposed to fish. But we got a super rod for Shoal Cave. Alright, Shoal Cave, come on. Shoal Cave, don't do this to me. Don't do this to me, come on. I know you want to give us something powerful with our very first super rod encounter. Super rod always gives you power. But we're probably going to get, like, an actual magic harp. Which I wouldn't be mad about because of Gyarados. But, please be something good. Please be something good, Super Rod. Once again, that is not a bad mon. This episode has been very good about giving us power for the PC. 
In all honesty, that is the thing this episode has done the most, is given us power for the PC. If I could catch this thing. I'm scared to hurt it, though, because I don't know who to hurt it with, where it's not gonna kill. You know what? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Let's just quick attack you down. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. You never know when you're gonna come out and do something against us that's gonna body. One more quick attack. Now we're gonna switch into Groudon. <laughs> so we can just eat your hits. Ultra Ball caught. Alright, we got a right on. It's horn which rotates like a drill, destroys tall buildings with one strike. It's one strike and it destroys a building. You know what we're gonna call you? Even though you're a girl and it might not fit too good, I don't know. We're gonna call you Demolition. Is that gonna fit? It's gonna fit perfect. That is a, a cool name, if you ask me. But Demolition, the Rhydon. And that is our Shoal Cave encounter. Are there items in here? I know there's a lot of items in Shoal Cave, actually. But, um, we're not gonna grab those. Because I do not want to make this episode too long. I do not want to make this episode too long. We might go back. But, that is gonna do it for us today, guys. Um, next episode, I think I'm just gonna go and get a ton of encounters, to be honest with you. And then we will come back to Moss Deep and do the space station, get ready for the gym, all of that. But if you guys enjoyed today's video, please make sure to leave a like down below to show your support. It does mean a lot to me, and I, I don't even know where I was going with that. I meant to say it means the world, but I said it means a lot. And I tried saying them both, but it means the world to me, guys. So I do appreciate it if you can leave a like. And as always, my name is Cubewack. I am signing out, and I will catch all of you guys next time. Peace!